David, the member for Lincoln, Lawrence. Uh, Mr. Speaker, I rise today with great sadness to relay the story about the tragic death of Elijah Marsh. As you know, three-year-old Elijah was found uh, frozen with no vital signs uh, beside a house in my riding last Thursday. Uh, young Elijah uh, is, uh, to say the least, uh, greatly, greatly missed by the whole community in Neptune, everybody across the country. In fact, I think Elijah's death has struck a chord around the world, his tragic death. And I would like to thank uh, the men and women in uh, 32 Division, Sam Fernandez, the Division uh, Superintendent, uh, who led the search, and the volunteers who came from across the GTA to search for Elijah. I'd like to also thank uh, all the uh, members of the community who are standing with the family right now, uh, getting them through this incredible uh, grief that they're uh, having to endure. And out of this horrible death, uh, it's just remarkable the amount of uh, good that this tragedy has uh, elicited from people. I know uh, when I was there the other day, there was a group of students from Dante High School who stopped and said the Our Father beside a little makeshift vigil where Elijah it was marked his passing. So uh, we uh, say to uh, Elijah's family and the greater community at Baycrest and at Neptune that uh, rest in peace, Elijah, and out of your tragic death, you've inspired us all to come together and uh, remark on what is important in this life, and that is taking care of our children. Thank you very much, Mr. Speaker. Thank you.